when we finished this record, I went to mastering and I thought I was finished. And then Jay comes in, walks into mastering, he sits down and I'm like, I'm calling him to listen to the sequence and you know, like the spacing in between the records. And while he's sitting there, he goes, okay, I got a better verse for that record. So we're like at mastering, you know what I'm saying? And we run back to the studio, <laughs> re-record a verse. And I don't, you know, artists don't always understand like if you, okay, yeah, you want to switch out a verse, it's real quick, I already mixed the record, I can fit it back in real quick, but then that means I have to do seven passes again. I have to do the main, the instrumental, the TV, the clean, um, you know, w whatever all these other passes are. So we do that, we go back, I go back to mastering again, I put it back together. Uh, run back to the studio, he listens again, and then he starts naming all these things that he wants to change. Now, mind you, he's going on vacation the next day, right? right? It's like him and Beyonce sitting in the studio. Uh, one of the, We call him OG Juan, which is Jay's partner with the 4040s. He's also the owner of the studios. He's finding all of this super hilarious, right? Like, this is super funny to him because he knows I'm not going to sleep. And they're about to go on vacation. Like, their bags are packed, and they're like, all right, we're out the door. So as I'm sitting there, you know, it becomes one thing, two things, three things, and I'm like, all right, I need to start breaking out the paper. So I break out a piece of paper, and by the time Jay's done, it's like there's seven different things that he wants to change. So it's like that became the joke of the, of the night because I'm like, all right, I'm really not going anywhere.